Alright guys, Pitbike Sonic here and in today's video we are going to be doing a lap of Red Lodge Cart Circuit in Suffolk just outside Fetford. Red Lodge Cart Circuit I find is one of the most unique circuits we come to all season. Um, it's the only track we go to that is anti-clockwise, so that means it is predominantly left-handed corners, not rights. So a lot of fine people find it very tricky to learn. Um, I find it is one of the trickiest tracks to learn, especially for new people. Um, it's very technical, uh, got some real tight twisty bits, but it's also got some really fast flowing corners. Um, but it does take you a while, get used to go around that opposite way to which most tracks do go. My personal best here is a 47.3 and the lap record is set by Fab Racing 2022 champion Rossi Bannum at a 45.9. Here we go then, a lap of Red Lodge. Exit in the final corner in third, up into fourth. Just as you cross the start and finish here, you wanna be aiming for the yellow line for the exit of the pit lane just here so you can get as much swing into the first fast left-hander. As you're going into the fast first left-hander, no brakes, just roll off the throttle a little bit, aim for the kerb on the left-hand side, and then sit it up for a bit to put yourself as wide as you can for the second left-hander and drop a gear into third. You wanna keep a wide line all the way in and then just kissing the apex right at the last minute ready to flick yourself back over for this right hander. Watch out as you're coming out of this first right hander, it's really easy for the rear end to step out because you're on cold tyres um, and it's the first time the right side of the tyre is being used so it's very easy to go down on this first right hander. As you come out of the right hander, get straight back across to the right side of the track, ready to flick yourself in for the first left. Get as close as you can to these tyres on the inside here for this left hander and then once again flick it over back for this right hander. What you want to do is you want to have your elbow just rubbing on these tyres on the inside. Head towards the kerb on the way out and just keep turning it. Keep the bike turning right all the way around till you aim for this kerb just here and then get yourself to as close as you can to that white line on the right hand side. Ready to flick yourself over for this really tricky off camber left hand. Once again, this is a very easy corner to go down on, especially in the wet. Um, as soon as you come out of here, you're going to use all the curbs on the way out of here on the right hand side. As you come out of here, down this straight, up into fourth gear. And just before you turn into this really fast left hander, drop it into third. The bike will be revving its tits off, but you just keep it in third all the way around. With the bike revving so hard, it really helps you keep the corner tight. Just before the corner starts to tighten up, let the bike just drift out wide, keeping it in third gear. Then just as the corner is at its tightest on the left, get your knee right over the kerb. Keep, try and keep yourself as tight as possible on this left-hander. And then just when it's about to flick right, you've got as much room to flick yourself over to the right-hand side to get your speed coming down the hill. Once again, this is really easy to crash coming out of this right as the bike has got a very small contact patch as you're about to go downhill so very easy for the rear to step out down this straight back up into fourth gear into the final flip flop before the start and finish you want to get yourself as tight as possible on this right hand that literally in between the white line and the kerb as you can see here to give yourself as much as a straight line for the final left hander once again get as over as much as possible your knee wants to be on the kerb here so you can get your power down as quick as possible going onto the start and finish straight onto the kerb on the way out and that is a lap of red lodge cart circuit Cheers guys for watching this lap of Red Lodge Cart Circuit. Like I said, I find it's one of the most technical tracks we go to and definitely one of the hardest to learn. Um, but it can also be really enjoyable. They do track evenings here at the end of Mondays every month. So make sure to get you down there and get loads of practice in before you do your first race meeting. Cheers guys for watching. If you haven't already subscribed, make sure to hit that subscribe button and there's some link to some more videos as well. Cheers guys for watching and I'll speak to you soon.